April with Primitive Mommy, and I'm going to show you how I make my nut met butters that I don't make homemade. Um, I'm going to use sunflower seed butter here, and I don't like that it's high in omega-6s, so what I do with any kind of nut butter um, that's high in omega-6 is I strain off the oil that comes with it, so I'm going to pour that out, and I add in my own oil which is, I'm going to use coconut oil. You can use olive oil, but I like the flavor of the coconut oil in my nut butters better. Um, you can do this with peanut butter, um, which is also high in omega-6s. I don't, however, recommend eating peanut butter because it's high in aflatoxins, and it's also sprayed um, a lot for pesticides. It's one of the crops that's highly sp sprayed for pesticides. So I'm going to go ahead and put this in my dish and I'm going to need both hands for that and then I'm going to combine it with my coconut oil. So I'll be right back. Okay so here it is. The sunflower seed butter and the coconut oil have been mixed together with my mixer. That's the key to getting it nice and smooth and the way I knew how much oil to use is I just poured it out of the sunflower seed butter one time to see how much oil was in there and then I replaced it with coconut oil. So a third cup was the amount in there of a 16 ounce jar. So it's all nice and smooth, smooth now. Now what we're going to make with it is a special treat. It's a Nutella replacement. Now you can use hazelnuts, is what's traditionally used in Nutella, um, but hazelnut butter is not easy to come by and you can make your own too, but I don't always have hazelnuts on hand even though they're one of my favorites. So what I'm going to add here is two, and I don't ever on stuff like this I'm not real accurate but two tablespoons of cacao. You can use cacao or carob in this and then we're also going to do a heaping spoonful of honey. If I can do this one handed. So we'll get that in there and then this bottle looks like a stevia bottle but this is actually my homemade vanilla so I'm gonna put about a teaspoon of vanilla in there so I'm gonna go ahead and combine that together all right so here it is our finished product the Nutella substitute um, you can add more cacao if you would like it more chocolatey than this um, I like it this chocolatey and I like to add coconut oil to as many foods as I can throughout the day so that I don't end up eating it by the spoonful to get my daily amount that I want. Um, coconut oil is so good for you. I've spoke about it before but it's full of median chain fatty acids and lauric acid and so many health promoting properties to it so um, especially if you have like Alzheimer's running in your family, you really want to try and incorporate this into your diet. And it's really quite easy once you get rid of the other oils um, to use coconut oil on a daily basis. So, hope you enjoy your Nutella substitute. I know my boys are going to enjoy digging into this. So, see you next time. Bye bye. <music>